swapping this around because it's always fascinating to see what I look like. I don't have any mirrors yet, so. Got a bit of a bruise here. My CPAP mask, I was tightening it really hard the last couple of weeks because <clears throat> it wasn't working. Um, and instead, I loosened it, but I trimmed off the mustache, which I, I think I didn't have when I first got the CPAP. Anyway, um, you can probably tell sleep has not yet <laughs> improved. Anyway, so where are we at? All right, there's there's the box. Uh, it was 40 percent used, just maybe 20 percent left. Why? Because I did a second fill, not the corner, so I'm gonna have to come back. But second fill all along the beam and the columns. I'm gonna have to come over here. The strangest outcome actually was that this thing here barely took any fill at all, whereas everything else is. Uh, accepting great gobs of mud. I'm not entirely sure why. And then, I don't know how I missed it the first time, but I went back to anywhere I had corner bead and I filled that. So this first first coat, so please ignore the dog's breakfast. That will, um, the first thing is it shrinks like crazy. I tried not to use too much water in this. I just put it on pretty much, uh, and you can see all the bubbles. Can you see all the, yes, you can see all the bubbles because I didn't spend a lot of time um, watering it down because it just makes it shrink more. Anyway, got it done, got it done. And also all of the screw holes uh, have had a second coating. And obviously a little bit of work down there to get rid of the last of the mud on the um, hawk. Uh, what can I tell you? I, I felt like I was spending hours and hours and hours doing this. I think as I'm recording this, it's like 8 p.m. And I started at 5.30. So that's two and a half hours approximately. But two and a half hours straight without break. And it's a bit of a change. There's some change going on. I don't know how much of it I really want to talk about here. This is this is a, a, a channel, a playlist about a renovation. I'm the guy doing the renovation, so maybe the stuff that affects me personally belongs here, and maybe it doesn't. I don't know, but I don't... Since I'm not entirely sure... You know what? It's a public blog. Well, it's a stupid thing to think about. I have no idea who's going to see it. So I'll keep it to myself, or maybe put it somewhere else. But I do very much feel the need to express. And I can say all of this because I own it. I can cut it. I can cut it out so I can say sh like over the last couple of weeks, I've actually been dealing with the very real possibility that I'm, I haven't, I've or more. And yet, especially over the last couple of weeks, um, I have really, 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 really been, and I can say that because I get to cut this out of the video. Never hear me say it. Well, you won't hear it on YouTube anyway. Yeah, so the thing is that uh, really, really, this, this, it doesn't make any sense whatsoever. As I say, I haven't even been two years. And some of the exploration that I've been doing personally over the last little while suggests that um, I, I can't trust at all. So the fact that I maybe, uh, I can't, I can't trust that. I can't, I can't count on it. So I can't even, uh, you know, take the next step, which would be, I mean, I did, but for two months. <laughs> so uh, obviously. Yeah, so yeah, there's some shit and and maybe it's legit, maybe it's not. No, okay, let's take a step back. There's some shit. The problem is that I have who, and I mean, I, I'm exaggerating here, but I used to make jokes that a life-changing epiphany every three f***ing months. So it got to the point where who gives a shit? It's probably the same shit you figured out three months ago and forgot and then just figured out again. So clearly you didn't actually change anything in your life in the ensuing three months because you wouldn't have forgotten. And so because of that, I can't trust the epiphanies that are, I feel like I can't trust the epiphanies that I have. So I'm kind of stuck. I'm doing a lot of reading. I'm noticing lately that I'm more motivated to get this shit done than ever. I'm not entirely sure why. Maybe it's so that I can that I just mentioned and, and say, hey, let's go. I don't know. I don't know. I really don't know how I feel about that. Do I, I mean, do I or do I not? I certainly have and I think that's reasonable. That's rational. I'm really, really, truly. Um, I have some. Yes. It's not quite the same though, is it? There's a lot that I, I don't. There's a lot that I feel like I cannot. So. 
So there we go. All right. That feels good. I'm going to go delete shit now. <laughs>